Hey everybody, thanks for watching Great Day Colorado. I'm Spencer Thomas. All right, we all know Halloween is about a week away and there are many fun festivities leading up to this week or the big day on Monday, next Monday. So this Wednesday, Union Station in Denver is transforming into Boonian Station. I love that. It's a free family-friendly event filled with costume contests, face painting, and so much more. GDC's Cheryl Huang is live at Union Station this morning to give us a little sneak peek, or should I say Boonian Station? They're already starting, Cheryl. What's up, girl? Good morning, Spencer. You don't see me now, but <laughs> did I scare you? Did I scare you? <laughs> I love her. I hope I did. All right. So yes, we are at Union Station. We're talking all about Boonian Station here this morning. Right now, there's not a lot of Halloween decor just yet, but don't worry. They're putting it up this morning. Uh, by the end of today, it's going to get really spooky here at Union Station. And if you haven't heard about Boonian Station, to tell us all about it here is Brandon Hansen this morning, <laughs> Food and Beverage Director here at the Union Station. How's it going? It's going very well. How are you doing this morning? <laughs> Good. Okay. Tell us more about Boonian Station. Sure. So this is our eighth year to do it, and it's a uh, basically a trick or treat parade is what we call it. So the Boonian Station Trick or Treat Parade starts out on Wincoop Plaza, and we invite all of Denver's costume characters, old and young, to come on down. It's a free activation, and it's a parade that starts, like I said, out on the plaza, comes all the way through Union Station and then all the Union Station businesses will give out candy as the kids are coming through and Fun. then we also have other things happening like face painting we have a balloon artist there's a, a mini train that'll be running out on the plaza as well oh uh, the kids are gonna love that oh absolutely it, it's really a blast and we get so many people that come down uh, and then we uh, to also turn it into a costume contest as well that's my <laughs> oh. favorite part did I scare you with these by the way that these little uh, they little... would win I think if you came I mean that's they really right do. thank <laughs> you <laughs> so we do first second and third prizes for that and uh, it, just a little inside scoop. The judges seem to really like it when we do th when families do themed costumes do Ooh. very well. So just going to put that out there. I've seen a lot of those this year already. I know families. I have friends uh, who have kids. I don't have kids, but the friends who do are looking for some things to do. It's Halloween week. I think Absolutely. it's fair to say everybody's <laughs> in Halloween spirit right now, and they have to come down here for the cool parade. Yeah, 100%. Couldn't agree more. So from 4 to 7 this Wednesday, the 26th is when we're running it. <laughs> yeah. So I was just talking to the girls downstairs at the Crawford Hotel at the front desk. They said this is one of their favorite holiday events uh, of the year. It's a black. I mean, I think we get more people down for this event than we do for any other one. So it's really so much fun. And because it is for the community and it's free and the kids and the costumes and it's just a blast to walk around and see all the fun. I know. OK, so there's other events also, uh, mm -hmm. not just the trick or treaters, uh, the trick or treat parade. What else is going on this week? So then this Friday, we've got our Hocus Pocus Halloween oh, Opus. I love it. Hocus Pocus Halloween Opus. Which is going to be a 90s theme party. This is a 21 and up 90s theme party that's going to be happening uh, that is sort of uh, inspired by the Hocus Pocus movies. And so we'll have a DJ dancing, lots of fun drinks. It's going to be a blast. We've been talking about it all uh, last week, too, Hocus Pocus. And tickets are almost sold out. They are. So they're $45. You can get them online at unionstationindenver.com. But we've got literally just a few left so please get on and buy some go get tickets uh, again it's not spooky yet but Union Station is about to get oh, pretty it's gonna spooky get later. very spooky yes the, some of the crows are going up already there's a lot of history here at Union Station I was just telling you earlier that uh, I was on a haunted tour of, of Denver and Union Station was one of the locations I think that's fantastic I know you have <laughs> to start to you have to come out here for Union Station this Wednesday again where can people find more information uh, more information is on our website at unionstationindenver.com and you'll find out about Union Station about the Hocus Pocus Halloween opus and all the other fun things we're doing how fun come out here guys this <laughs> wednesday I absolutely love that. And I love Cheryl always commits. She commits to the costume. She commits to the report. She's got the ears on. That intro was my favorite. Union Station never <laughs> disappoints. Cheryl, thank you so much for all that good information. The week of Halloween, it's always a lot of fun. Appreciate it. See you out here. All right. See you there. Wednesday. <laughs>